obtained his title winning the 2017 Ironman African Championships in Port Elizabeth. Hoffman also made history by breaking the course record, finishing in a time of 7 hours and 57 minutes. The 13th African Championship saw athletes from 69 nations taking part. As early as 6 o'clock this morning, more than 2,000 athletes took to the sea for the 3,8 kilometer swim. Leading the men was Josh Hamburger, and then Danila Riff led the women's athletes. But when it got to the cycling defending champion Ben Hoffman and Cameron Wolf were neck to neck. Hoffman proved too strong and dominated the cycle far ahead of the rest. The defending champion not only retained his title, but also broke the course record. I mean, it's obviously really awesome to win a race it's what you train for and to defend a title I mean I've won now six Ironmans but this is the first time I've defended an Ironman title so it's really special and you know to have a regional championship again under my belt um, you know I'm over the moon it's really awesome. In the ladies race defending champion Cassie Littonen was a good contender as defending champion but the determination of Dinella Riff proved too strong. She dominated throughout the race and eventually took first place. I was a bit injured before the race. Um, I couldn't train for about almost a week and um, I didn't know if I was um, be able to finish today. And to have such a race, um, of course, it was not the best I can do normally, but it was um, very, very solid for the circumstances. And um, yeah, that made me very happy. Yeah, Those who attended said it was the best Ironman since. Oh, well, it's so well organized, uh, probably the best ever, and uh, I believe it's one of the best in the world, from what I've heard. PE hosts one of the best Ironmans in the world, but we had to support every athlete. They are so brave, so courageous, and I'm inspired. Yes, and we're also supporting friends of ours, so we, we're really excited to be here today. What a beautiful day. I mean, this year was really nice, especially that it's live this year for the first time, so it's really awesome. South Africa's favorite Kyle Beckenham took fourth place. The organizers say they are delighted with the growth of the event. Nerato Tipa, SABC News, Port Elizabeth.